Today's video is going to be AG Softball Hamster's 50 plus subscriber contest entry. Hey YouTube, it's Jackie. In today's video, I am going to share with you Tom and Jerry's story on how they became to be my hamsters. So it all started a couple months after my hamster Jojo passed away and I told my mom I was ready for a new hamster. So she took me to the pet store and I didn't want to get a Syrian because they have to live independent. I wanted to get dwarf hamsters because they get to have a companion. And so I decided to pick up the Campbell Russian dwarf hamsters. And when I brought them home that night, I had a really bad allergic reaction. Like I started sneezing and coughing and I couldn't breathe that well. And I was like, oh my goodness, it was horrible. So the next morning my mom took me to return them. And I still wanted a hamster and I wanted dwarfs still. And so we were looking around but I didn't see any um, Winter Whites on display because I was looking at Winter Whites. I was doing information on them and they seemed really cute and adorable. So they didn't have any on, a, on display so I asked this lady if they had any in the back and she told me that they had two Winter Whites in the back and it was surprisingly because she didn't want me to see them at all. It was really weird because usually if there's a customer that wants to see your pets, you would let them and you would like be nice to them. But she was not nice to me at all. Like She did not want to sell these hamsters away and I can see why because they are adorable. But anyway, so she took me to the back and I got to look at them, but it was really strange because like she didn't really let me hold them and she kept like talking about like how she's going to buy them soon and I was like, okay, well this is strange. I like really like these hamsters. So I got to pet them and stuff and I fell in love with them at first sight. They were so calm and tame and just gorgeous. So the next day my mom came and I came in and we were going to purchase the two winter lights and I was trying so hard not to run into her. So we had another gentleman um, like exchange them with the winter lights and then she comes out and I'm just like oh my gosh no and then she comes in like starts almost crying and she's like no I wanted to buy them don't take them away from me and all this like guilt trip and then she like holds them up to her face and starts petting it and kissing it and I'm like oh, these are my hamsters now and stuff like that and then she gets aggressive and starts saying that oh well these ham if you were allergic to the camp bells and you're gonna be allergic to the winter lights so you shouldn't even buy them because they're the same type of fur and I was like okay well I'm going to buy them anyway and if I am allergic I still want to try them out and see if I really am allergic because you never know so I brought them home and they I wasn't allergic to them at all they were just so gorgeous and wonderful they adapted their, to their cage quite quickly and I love them to death like they are so adorable and cute and so I learned from that experience that if I'm ever going to get a hamster I always need to check and I always need to like stay firm with the with the pet care person because if I would have just given up and said okay then I would have never had Tom and Jerry in my life so I'm so thankful for that. the questions. What type of hamster do I have? I have two winter white dwarf hamsters. Their coloring is normal. Um, their names are Tom and Jerry. They are almost six months old, I think. Well, I've almost had them for six months. And why do I want to win? I want to win this so badly. I haven't won a package from anybody yet, and I'm hoping that I can win soon because Tom and Jerry, I know they would just love, love to have new toys and cages. Also, um, later I was thinking I wanted to get a Syrian again because Syrians are a lot like easier to like hold and handle because dwarfs are smaller. And I just really wanted another one, and so I'm going to need toys and stuff for them. And so it would just really mean a lot to me if I could win your contest. I would be so grateful for everything. And also, I just want to congratulate you once again for getting all of the subscribers that you have. 50 plus subscribers is a lot. I can't wait until I get 50 plus subscribers because hopefully I will be able to hold a contest just like you. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my story. Also, if you guys were wondering what I'm housing my hamsters in for this video, it is just a small bin that I put some bedding in and a couple of treats and a um, chinchilla sand bath. This is just like to show you my hamsters more clearly and also so they can have a sand bath. Harry was in the first part and now Tom is in the second part of my video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to AG Softball Hamster. Love, Tom and Jerry.